Ventoy. It is an absolute amazing tool and one that I've used for about the past year, but it just keeps getting better and better. Every single month I update this thing, it adds a new feature, whether it's launching directly into an image or adding more ISO compatibility. I can't tell you how much this tool has saved my bacon. So with that said, let's just jump right into this uh, tool. Go right to downloads, download it for whatever you want, Windows, Linux. Uh, I think you can even run this on Mac. Uh, you can go right into the GitHub releases. Everything's open source, everything's free. So nothing to buy, nothing like that. Uh, we'll just download this for Linux and I'll extract this uh, right on my command line. So let's just go into my downloads and we'll just do an extraction of Ventoy and we'll go into the directory and Ventoy you can run right here. Uh, obviously on Windows, you can just run the executable from your command prompt as well. It doesn't matter. We'll do just a Ventoy to disk to install it. So we can just do Ventoy to disk and I'm just gonna hit that and you can kind of get like a actual readout of everything it can do. Obviously you can install it directly to a USB drive like this, but I don't even use it like this anymore. Uh, they used to only do like USB drives, but now you can actually install it directly to hard drives. So I have uh, some old SATA disks. So instead of wearing out a bunch of USB drives, which <laughs> for those that remember the six hour long Debian install live stream I did, uh, about a couple hours of that was just because the USB drive was bad uh, from me using it too much, where if you install it directly on a disk, so much more reliable. But anyways, let's let's just take a look here. Uh, I believe I already have it installed. Let's look down here. I think it's SDE is where it's installed. But you would install this to just do that same command. You would do a dot I and then you would do dev SDE. Just like that would install it. Obviously, I don't want to do that. I would probably want to do an update. So let's let's just do a U and then do a dev SDE. And since I didn't do this as super user, it won't allow me. We'll go ahead and do it as super user. It says, okay, it's on 1.044. It's going to upgrade it to the same. Obviously, I've, I've recently updated this. So we're not going to continue. But that's how you'd update it to install it. Obviously, just switch the U with an I. And that's it. So let's go ahead and boot into this Ventoy. And I'm just going to show you some of the stuff I have on here. So I'm going to just close this out and restart the computer. Now, when starting up your computer, some uh, BIOSes have like F10 or F11 to go directly into a boot menu. Uh, sometimes I just hit delete or F2 to get into the BIOS itself and then just manually select it. Uh, so in my BIOS, I can just hit F8 and select my boot menu from here. And I'm just going to select uh, the Ventoy BIOS right here. And this is Ventoy. Now, I don't have too much on this drive just yet, but it's something that I'll probably just build out like I'm testing out the new Windows 10 21 H1 and some other stuff. But probably the biggest thing why you should have this on your thumb drive is not only just to have all these tools at your disposal, but what these do is amazing. I'm going to show Parted Magic real fast. I'll leave a link in the description if you want to check out Parted Magic. It is, I think, like a couple bucks to buy the recent version. And I'm going to make my own version of a restore prompt because there's some stuff in here I'd like and some I wish they had. But uh, look for that in here in the future. So here's the desktop of Parted Magic. Uh, much like any live CD you'd boot into. With Ventoy, you can have Parted Magic. You can actually, like, let's say you just wanted G-Parted. They actually have a completely free offering as well if you want to just use it for partitioning. I highly recommend having that in your repertoire. Another one I use all the time that's another live CD for utilities in Ventoy is Clonezilla, which is actually also part of Parted Magic as well. So you can use all these cleanup stuff for you Windows users. There's virus scanners. Uh, I've always, even back when I did real estate or not real estate, but residential virus removal and things of that nature, I would always uh, use an offline virus scanner without it actually being loaded into Windows. Obviously, cleaning a virus off when the virus is running is, is much more difficult than doing a clean sweep with the outside the OS. So that's why I always do this. It's a good tool for everyone to learn. Um, and yeah, that's 
uh, kind of this ISO. As far as loading up different ones, I've tried a whole bunch of different ISOs that have been fantastic. I will say there's been just one or two that I had problems with. Now, the one or two I had problems with were more enterprise tools, such as setting up uh, a Zen server, how it partitions and does some wonky things during install. It had some issues with, which I think they actually have patched that. Uh, so definitely uh, know that this is almost a one size fits all. I used to recommend, I think it was Yummy a year or two back, I actually recommended it for multi booting. This is way better than that on every single level. Uh, the, the amount of work they've put into Ventoy is simply amazing. So let me know your thoughts down in the comments section below. Did I miss anything with Ventoy? Because it's such a fantastic project. You can actually go ahead and build everything yourself as well because it's all public on GitHub. So I, I don't know more, much more you could ask from a multi-boot tool. I know this has been my dream for about 20 years and just to see it come as a reality, I think it launched about two years ago and it's just steadily gotten better and better and better. So can't say enough good things about it. So thank you, Ventoy team. You guys are awesome. And uh, for you guys that aren't using Ventoy, what are you doing? I mean, come on, get with it. This is amazing. Try it out.